car that I always liked throughout the 90s was the Renault 25. I'd liked it ever since I'd seen one featured in a programme about prostitutes. Oh, it was lovely. The Renault 25 Monaco with the brown leather seats and all the electrics and this huge dashboard. It was basically a really big car that didn't look that big from the outside. So the first of my Renault 25s was a green one, 25 GTX, two litre, every electric going in there with their cloth seats somehow. It was a car that I really, really fancied having. So my purchase of this car was a bit of a disappointment. You see this one had an automatic gearbox and I bought it from a chap on a housing estate in Guildford and he said something like, I mean, the gears don't always work quite as they should do, but it probably needs a bit more fluid. Yes, I thought, yeah, I believe that. And I did believe that. I only had about eight miles to get home and I didn't make it before the gearbox decided to leave all of its juices all over a roundabout. The car was relayed home and uh, the next day I went looking for a gearbox and found that a reconditioned gearbox was about a thousand pound, which is probably about four times the amount I paid for the car. So that didn't happen, but it didn't put me off.